Okay, I just want to say this before we start this video. I know I have very low credibility when it comes to XP Boost videos because that video blew up and now I'm making another one. So I guess you could find me a little bit of sus on this. But, you know, we all hate this game. We despise it deep inside. And we want to just get over with and level up in a way because you don't want to play the game anymore. But you want to try the weapons. Weapon. So now a disclaimer, I don't actually have the gameplay of this specific method that I want to show you because first of all, we're not playing in all our warfare or the portal server. We're actually going to be playing in hazard zone. So I'm just going to be borrowing some clips and, you know, I'll credit these hazard zone videos on YouTube that I found link in the description is to the original people who po posted these gameplay and basically you get a shit ton of XP playing this game mode now I know you might find it a little bit sus I get it I get it like I'm not I don't have like an actual evidence but here you go 21,000 XP this is by completing and winning hazard zone in the first extraction at eight minutes so it is some work you know first work is that being able to find a server <laughs> to play first and the second work being actually knowing how to play hazard zone because i don't think people specifically bought battlefield 2042 because they wanted to play hazard zone I, I i'm aware that a lot of people bought this to play portal I get it. You don't want to play as a zone, but this is the best XP thing that you can get right now. Because do you want to mindlessly shoot bots that don't really actually shoot back at you and unlock some attachments for your guns or actually play the game? Of course, you want to play the game because the other method doesn't work anymore. That's already been patched. So to explain this in the simple terms, because I have not played as a zone myself, but I watched uh, gameplay and people explaining how it actually works. Basically, it's like a hard man showdown or escape from Tarkov kind of thing. But in here, you're retrieving data drive. You're going to extract it and other teams are going to extract it too. So people are going to be fighting for it and also there, there are other AI in the game protecting it. So there are two extraction times. There's the first one at 8 minutes mark and the second one at 15 minutes mark. So if you've missed the first one, you can still go for the 15 minutes one. Now, here's the catch. You don't need to win it. You don't need to win to get that XP. You don't need to win Hazard Zone or, and actually extract it at all. You just need to get to 15 minutes mark. If 15 minutes is when Hazard Zone is going to end, no matter what, it's just gonna end at 15. So, you don't need to extract anything, data drive, if you don't want to play, you could sit around and try to survive for 15 minutes. I know it's going to be boring, but you can sit for 15 minutes and you can actually get about 15,000 XP by just getting through to the end of the game. You also get more XP on your first like times playing Hazard Zone because there are also like challenges that you can get. But yeah, like you don't need to win for 15,000. But, you know, if you want to get this done quickly, there are ways to, you know, not actually engage with other enemy teams. Instead, you just fight the AI, just get the drive and just run away and get it done in eight minutes. And that way you can get this beautiful 21,000 XP right here. That's an easy XP if I ever see one. And it's not like you need to get an, an XP boost server or like XP bots farm specific servers because I just find it dumb that that has to be a thing in the game like this. That's it. That's basically it. That's all you need to do. Just play as a zone, <laughs> whether you like it or not. But you don't need to play all out warfare. That's one thing for sure. You don't need to get in the service, as I said, uh, like in that last video that up you know um it got a lot of views but i don't know if this one is gonna work out as well because that one i showed me playing on a server that had one side with guns and another bigger team with out guns <laughs> it's like a knockoff of infection game except you're paying 60 dollars to play it and in that i showed you that it didn't work anymore even though the server said like xp farm bot thing i don't i don't remember but it, it, it actually only got me 3,000 XP, like on the screen here. That's, um, that's 
That's five times less than not even winning a Hazard Zone game. So yeah, it, 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 Hazard Zone just works great, even if you don't win. And that's it. That's all you need to do for XP. But um, here I try to get to 8 minutes mark and I tell you something real quick. I don't know the future contents that I can make on this game because I... The more I play, the more I see this game, the more I despise it. I get it that the weapon bloom spread has been addressed and it's been fixed quite all right, you know. You know it's still not perfect, I can I, I can assure you that. Uh, but it's very boring. It's very dull, especially coming back from a game like Halo Infinite with such amazing and satisfying gunplay. I just want to play that instead. Why am I playing this? You know, Like every time I'm playing this game, I'm just instead thinking of Cortana's big pair of personalities it's just dull even if the weapon are balanced and now they actually can shoot people now all the guns just perform similarly in the like similar fashion the thing is they only look different they only have different ammo counts it has one of the laziest balancing thing ever like it, yeah oh oh it's an assault rifle so it shoot further um, by the way, submachine guns shoot a bit closer, you know, but it's still accurate. All of them are accurate now. <laughs> so, like, I don't get it. I don't get this game. I don't get the point of its existence. It, it, I, I, I don't want to brand further. I just want to let you know that it's hard to get contents on this game. So, if you want to recommend me what to do on here instead of just trying to XP boost, XP glitch, XP farm thing, you know, let me know in the comment section and I'll be sure to look at it. That's it for today's video, I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope if you're playing the game and you want to try new weapons and uh, unlock attachments, then give Hazard Zone a go because it's easy. That shit's easy, like 15 minutes bro. Or, or even better, you just go for 8 minutes mark, you know, just run that shit out of there, like you don't need to fight the enemies, you don't need to engage them. That's it, I'll see you guys, have a good one, Bye bye bye